So recently Sniper Wolf has been making the rounds again because of a guy that she's been getting into beef with by the name of Jax Films. So Jax Films is this, he's this sort of untouchable YouTube creator. He's one of, as as uh, Omni says, he's one of the untouchables. You know, he's, he's this big guy. He's, in, he's absolutely fucking enormous, right? Like he's seen as like a very wholesome YouTube creator. And he, uh, he's recently gotten into beef with Sniper Wolf because YouTube made a tweet claiming that Sniper Wolf said that that she is all about innovating and changing her content. Now, that's just a, a blatant lie. Sniper Wolf does not change her content. Her content is recycled garbage. Uh, not like I'm one to talk. You know, it's not like my videos are like all that great, right? I know that's a crazy self-deprecating opinion to have, but you know, I, I don't make YouTube videos like I used to, right? Like I'm just daily uploading. But her content is like worse. Her content is worse than a lot of people's content. Like her content is essentially the quality equivalent of watching some like third world country channel upload their first video and the accent is so thick that you can't even like understand what they're saying. Like that that's the quality of content that you're watching. It's like scrolling through YouTube shorts. This shit is like brain damage. This shit is mind-numbingly stupid, right? But she got into a beef with Jax Films, who basically fucking owned her, right? He went after, uh, he, he went after her quality of content, right? He didn't make fun of anything other than, like, he, he didn't make fun of anything other than how shitty her videos are. And I think that's, that's really fucking, like, admirable, in my opinion. Like, he, he had enough material to just fucking completely shit on her line of work, because her line of work is fucking pathetic she adds nothing right like at least i deliver a news story right like i'm not a groundbreaking fucking journalist but at least i like deliver something that sounds interesting to people right uh sh she's just she god she says the same four to five fucking things over and over again like i feel like i'm getting lobotomized every time i watch one of her videos bro it's so fucking painful you know the worst part my fucking family discovered like youtube the other day right like my fucking dad watched a couple snipers wolf videos and started telling me about how my analytics need to get up like hers like what the fuck <laughs> Her fucking, uh, her content is, oh, it's awful. But Jax Films was, in my opinion, entirely in the right. He made a entire, like, joke channel, uh, basically, like, sh like, fucking punking her, right? And people stayed long enough and liked the content long enough to stay consistently watching it. And then she tried to claim that him making that channel was him copying her, which isn't even close to the case. He was fucking punking her out. What up, gamers? It's your boy, Jaja Jax Films, and today, we're gonna watch TikToks that'll make you say grace to the Lord. Y'all ever wondered how they make paper? Like, uh, well, yeah, uh, it comes from a tree. You know, the tree gives its life and its soul, uh, to man, uh, you know, who owns it. And, uh, but I guess that beyond that, I've never really thought about, um, you know, where or how the process is, uh, you know, how the, how the tree and the wood becomes paperified. I, you know, uh, uh, color me, uh, color me, um, you know, intrigued and tickle me interested. Like from scratch, you know, we know. All right, so part one, paper making process part one. So we're we're using a, a looks like a Galdang sword, you know what I'm saying? Right, and now he's, she's just like further feeding into the bit that he was just like fucking destroying her, that he was he fucking humiliating her. She, like, this isn't even the first time that she's started acting like a fucking idiot in public. Eemstar released this video like a really long time ago about how she ghosted a cancer patient, a make-a-wish cancer patient, because he didn't want to, I guess. Like, she didn't want to hop on FaceTime with this kid. Like, the kid was asking. The kid reached out through Keemstar, right? The kid's mother reached out through Keemstar just to get in contact with Sniper Wolf so that Sniper Wolf, so that, like, this girl could meet her fucking idol, right? And as much as I dog on her content, it's very clearly made for kids, right? It's very clear. It has a very clear demographic. And so when this kid reached out, uh, they made plans. Never fucking happened. Ne absolutely never happened happened this kid never saw a single second with her because i guess she just thinks she's you know too good for a, a dying fucking child right this this bitch is insufferable right like she's fucking evil i have no i have no sympathy for anything that befalls this lady uh at the depths that she's stooped right i i 
like i saw people like fucking like turkey tom claiming that it's like not good that uh what's his name jack's films like added youtube and shit and ordinarily i would completely agree i think that's a terrible precedent to set but when you've got a grade a scumbag like this on your fucking website i think it's perfectly acceptable to like tattletale a little bit you know i think i think it's ordinarily not the best right i i think it's ordinarily not fucking cool but i i definitely think she kind of deserved it in this scenario um just because she's been on the fucking platform acting like a total like dipshit for so long like producing this this is like youtube shorts quality i'm surprised she hasn't started getting on youtube shorts right the the fucking money he brags about would just be it would like continue to roll in she has like shit loads of money because i guess she has like i i don't know if maybe she does like an only fans or some shit i don't know but like she's got fucking bill like fucking millions of dollars rolling in because her adsense is so fucking off the charts bro like it's crazy it's absolutely crazy fucking like she made this like video where she was like touring her mansion and shit and she looked completely lifeless she looked like a corpse like she didn't have any sort of personality like her eyes were fucking glassy and glazed over dude that like that shit was fucking crazy that shit was wild to me bro like goddamn, she's she's legitimately like the most hollow like fakest person on the planet and like i remember like every time you hear some shit come out about her right, it's never good right <laughs> like it's never it's never like a fucking mr beast or ludwig type deal or like the shit about their personal lives you hear is is like positive right like you you hear shit about ludwig's personal life and you're like holy shit man he's kind of a good guy right or you hear shit about like fucking mr beast his his like personal life and you're like holy fuck he's kind of based right no th this bitch is evil <laughs> She's like terrible. Every single time you hear something come out about her, it's like the worst, most like satanic shit on the planet. Like, god damn. I'm, I, if she, uh, if the cash flow stops rolling in for her, I wouldn't really care because like, it's not like she's fucking dying, right? Like if she was like on her deathbed, right? From obesity, like Boogie2988, I'm like, it's whatever. Uh, like keep the cash flow rolling, but she's not about to die. Uh, I feel like it, and I don't want her to get deplatformed, right? But if she, if bad things befall her, I wouldn't fucking care, right? Like, I just wouldn't, I just can't care. But I, you know, I, I hope, I hope her channel does pretty well. You know, I, I hope, I hope nothing but the best, you know? Like, that's, that's my, my main sort of, sort of takeaway is like, I hope she changes her content and starts making like actual fucking content and grows like a personality randomly, you know? But she's probably not gonna, she's probably just gonna keep making the same dog shit. The, recy the same like recycled dog shit over and over again so it's like it's whatever you know shit isn't gonna change all right uh you know i hope you all have a have a wonderful time okay i hope you guys have a great time have a great day uh and i'll talk to you guys later bye bro talk shit when you running him down he almost moved with a gang no no that shit is not advised i've been i'ma come up now some people with no rise they ain't got no money and they not up no surprise no, no, no. man rapping i'm a